Raj, I didn't expect to see you today. Paperwork, man. All right, I got it. Guys heading out? Yeah, they found a body out in Stoner Hill. Really? What do you think you're doing? They're gonna tag along, you guys don't mind, right? I thought you had paperwork today. Man, I like paperwork even a little bit less than I like you. Somebody sure want him dead. Yeah, I count about 20 bullet wounds on him. Do you know who he is? Nope, no ID. But we did find $200 in his pockets. Well, that takes robbery off the table, right? You think this is drug related? Oh, there's no doubt about it. All right, I guess we'll contact CSI, have him run the fingerprints. Jenkins, you're with me on this one. Thanks for the extra set eyes, Emery. What's going on with your DB? Any luck matching it to a print? Some guy named Anthony Crane. Two thirds of the tips mention Crane has been involved on the periphery of one drug dealer's operation. And the man who ordered his murder might have been the one who's running. He's running more dope through Shreveport than any other dealer. And if anybody gets in his way, he won't hesitate to take him out. Is there anything concrete we can pin on him? Not really. So who's this new guy that Waco's running with? His name's Kevin Smith. If there's anything we can do to help, you let us know. OK, thanks. It's a good start. Did Candace say anything to you about being upset or, or running away? No, nothing I can remember, no. When's the last time you saw Candace? I just saw her after school yesterday. So you said you had some information about Candace that might be helpful to us. <sighs> Something happened to Candace. Something bad. What if I told you we have DNA evidence that you were at the crime scene that night? 